Hello, here we are with a quick comparison of the HTC Desire 500 in lacquer black against the Glacier Blue. Now you can check out our YouTube channel for uh, an unboxing and hands-on with this device. So we're not actually gonna be comparing specifications or anything like that or running through the spec list. We're just gonna be comparing colors because one of the common questions we get is which color should I go for? And it's often a personal one, but sometimes you want actual feedback from um, hands-on use. So starting on the back here is where we can see a lot of the difference um, between the two units. So the overall profile is exactly the same, it's the, the color uh, differences, the materials are the same. So on the back here, we've got this gloss sort of finish. Um, here you can see the HTC logo um, stands out considerably more on the Glacier Blue model than the black it's just in sort of a grey colour um, there and you might just pick up the the way the sort of picks up sort of fingerprints or grease on the back cover um, because it's got that sort of glossy finish on the white whilst it's glossy it doesn't pick up the fingerprints quite the same or you can't really see them uh, as such as the grease so there is a massive advantage there for sort of greasy finger marks but sort of dirt and that uh, is likely to show up more on the um, white back cover around the camera it stands out considerably more with this sort of uh, blue framing around it. The blue, um, it's called Glacier Blue, it almost looks like a turquoise sort of greeny colour uh, in certain lights. Um, you know, initial impressions would be it's more of a turquoise than a blue probably, but it's quite nice. And down at the bottom, the Beats Audio logo, and um, both stand out, you know, reasonably equally but the speaker grill uh, down here probably stands out a bit more on the white because uh, of the drilled holes than it does on the black. If we then turn them over to look at the sides, so you can see on the black we've got black banding running around it, whereas on the blue one here we've got this blue banding running all the way around all the headphone jacks etc in the same position but you can see the differences between the two units there down the side, quite a bit of difference. There we've got a nice run of the, the lacquer blue, or the, sorry, the glacier blue, then down around the USB. On the front, there's less differences to really speak of because of the screen. That It's only really at the top here that we can actually uh, see the difference with the white framing up here so again the speaker grill stands out a bit and you can just see a little bit of the frame actually around uh, the side here which isn't quite so obvious on the black model and then if we actually remove the back covers uh, on these units so there's the inside of the black one let's take a look inside the white one Well, you can see they're the same. It's just that sort of back cover that really stands out as the difference, apart from the camera surround in here. The inside uh, is the same. One's not you know, white or blue or anything like that. So that's a quick comparison of the HTC Desire 500, available from clove.co.uk in uh, the variety of colors shown.